Hey guys, how's it going? This is week five of Project 19. But before we get into any of that stuff, I want to do my weekly question, because guess what? Someone actually asked a question. Actually, two people asked questions, but I'm only going to answer one this time. So let's go get my magical bag so that uh, I can answer a question. All right, so I'm gonna get my magical bag, a boom, and I'm just gonna go in and grab one of the comments, okay. So this comment says, I know you've done some work with realtor walkthroughs. I actually haven't done any realtor walkthroughs yet. I really, 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 really want to. It would be really fun to me, but I haven't yet. But um, do you think Sky Graphics would consider working with a design firm to help interior designers sell spaces to their clients? This is a really hard question to answer. Yes, 100%. I would absolutely love to work with an interior designer. That would be awesome to set up sets and, or just, you know, design a house and then kind of, you know, film that. And that, I just, that'd be fun. So yes, 100%, I would love to work with an interior designer. If you have any questions at all, you should ask some questions by the way <laughs> um, ask anything below that was about me but you can ask something about you um, you can ask about my favorite color I've said that in every video but <laughs> if you want to know my favorite color ask <laughs> so the week started off odd so like I told you guys last week and the week before that and probably the week before that <laughs> I raised my prices. Now, I had a few clients before I raised my price. I had one in particular. I told them that I was raising my prices and I gave them a slight discount from what I would usually charge. Um, they weren't happy with it, which I knew that was a possibility. And they asked me to send all of the files that I've done for them over to them. These are the project files, the ones that they can edit. I've never been asked this question before, <laughs> and I didn't know even if I was supposed to do something like that. Um, but I did go ahead and send over the files, or we're working on it. It's, a, it's 360 gigabytes of files, so <laughs> I'm working on a way to send it to them. But that was a little not sad. I'm fine now. I'm I can I've kind of moved past it. I was a little bit hurt when I when it first happened, but it's just because it's been this is the first time it's ever happened to me. So it's sad, but it's I get it. I understand it. I don't know if that means we're not working together anymore, but we'll see. My dog is freaking out for no reason. So that's fun. Other than that, I mean, it's been a pretty laid back week. I, I talked with another company this week and we're gonna, we're actually doing a meeting. So on Tuesday, I'm going to a meeting with this person and we're gonna discuss videos and I'm really excited. I, I think this will be good. I finished the church video. I finished pretty much every video except for the two bigger videos that um, I am working on. And I also am scheduling a meeting or I scheduled a meeting with someone from a college that I'm doing some videos for, which is really exciting. So I'll keep you guys updated as we keep going through the weeks. <laughs> Why'd I do that? But things are looking up. So for a tip, I guess I would say, you know what, okay, this tip is going to be about some advice that someone gave me, which is to not react to things immediately and to think about what you're going to say because Sometimes you get really angry or mad at things. I did, and in the moment you're freaking out like, oh my goodness, I'm so mad. I need to tell them I'm so mad. But if you just pause and <laughs> take a breath and then come back to the email, read it over, and then respond, um, your life will be a little bit easier. I definitely feel better about how I ended this relationship with this client because who knows, in the future maybe they'll want some more videos and they'll come back to me. But yeah, I, I think it's good to not overreact about things. 
on that note, I think that's pretty much it. There really wasn't a ton that happened this week, so I'll keep you guys updated, and yeah, I'll see you next week.